Rion is exposed to your eyes, I've been told you can go blind. Do you know what you're doing? We're Steph and Micah, and we're converting an ambulance into a camper. Last week we started tearing everything out of the interior, but this week we didn't really have a plan. So watch us jump around from the electrical to the tires to the decals and the AC unit. Cause yeah, we're a little all over the place. Swapped out the old console with all the switches for this bad boy. It was expensive. Okay, so, oh, what the heck? Those are the mangy bolts that I was looking for when I was attaching the license plate on the back. That was the whole thing. I was trying to figure that out. Anyways, I was just testing some of the fans and whatever, see if they're still good or not. And then one way to test it, you just cut the wires so you get a little bit of exposed copper. It works. Pretty cool. I finally decided that we are gonna pull this AC unit out. Hopefully I can attempt to disconnect it myself. An ongoing process, but we're gonna get it. Thank you. You're so excited. You're so excited. We're gonna test the brake lights, see if they work. Good? Yeah. That means that they are all connected right there. That makes things complicated. If it feels like I haven't done much, it's because it's, I haven't. And it's overwhelming. Every day it's kind of like this. It's just a lot. So for the most part, all of this Seems like it can come out, but just to be safe, I am going one wire at a time. Still intimidating. We just gotta go slow. We'll get it eventually. Nice butt, Micah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right now we're swapping out front tire for the back tire. We're gonna drive it over to the Ford dealership this week and get some new tires. When's the last time they uh, changed the wheels? <laughs> <laughs> Probably a while. A few thousand miles ago. <laughs> we just had our lunch break. Mm -hmm. Are we motivated to work? Super! <laughs> it was so hard. So we just did this side, obviously. And I think it looks good. When the fire rescue and all of that is going to be gone, it'll look nicer. Brian, you like it? I don't know what to Just by yourself. Today we just continued tearing out a lot of the wires. A lot. <laughs> a lot of wires. Like. That isn't even all of it. More wires, more wires, that tire. Hopefully we'll get our tires on couple days it'll be looking really nice. Look at your hands right now. That is dirty. See you guys on the flip side. Welcome to weekend four. This week we're just gonna be do what are we doing? <laughs> we just got it back from the shop. We got some new tires. We got the oil changed. Oh baby looks so good. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> We're writing a list for this weekend because we have a lot of things to do and we just want to make sure that we are on track. At this point, it's pretty evident we didn't have much of a plan, so we're trying to get organized. But even this list was a little ambitious, so we're trying to focus in on these things. Do you think that we're going to be able to do all of this? So we bought this wheel thing to get the decal off and Byron thinks it's a toy. You put it on a drill and it's just supposed to get all of this stuff out. So, we will see. We're gonna go through this really fast. Okay. 
Oh, she's taking all the decals off. The AC unit that I'm trying to take out is connected to the AC in the front of the vehicle, which is really annoying. There are two valves that you can shut off, so I should be able to disconnect it pretty safely. Hey, buddy. Anyways, I'm gonna try and get that out today. So you can see under here, these are the two valves that I'm talking about. And over on that side, we live out in the boonies, people are hunting, and that was a big boom. So you gotta be careful when doing this. If the prion is exposed to your eyes, I've been told you can go blind or get frostbite. Do you know what you're doing? Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's over here. I just took off these caps. What I'm going to do is tighten these ones, take those caps off, tighten those, and then disconnect it right here. And then I should only need something to cap off this thread right here. My wheel is like almost done, so I have to buy another wheel, but I'll show you. <laughs> Say hi to Micah. And I took the word rescue out and then ambulance. And then I have these two, but I think I might have to wait for another wheel. How's it going down there? Uh, it's going good. I just cut one of the coolant lines. So I'm just gonna do a little loop-de-loop -loop so it comes right here and then turns around. This is gonna be explosive if I can get this off. The fluid is gonna go everywhere. It's about to get messy. I'm just kinda of scared. Okay, so far so good. <clears throat> oh, I think I did it. I did it! I did it! I did it! Good job. No, wait, watch this. When I release this one, it's gonna pour out. Well, I think that was the exciting part. It's a little messy. <laughs> the grand finale. We should be able to pull this all the way up. Now, there's nothing holding the AC in there. I'm so happy. Is it heavy? Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm just filming you yes. struggle. <laughs> I got it. <laughs> wow. I'm so happy. Oh boy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so much more. Open? That took a lot of space. You did it. Hey guys, so that's the end of that video. And yes, it was a little abrupt, but I think it's just because we were a little unorganized this whole week. So yeah, I mean, that's, that's the end. But don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions about the build, we'd love to answer them. So leave those down in the comments below. That's it, we'll see you next week. Today we're doing the windows. I got him. I've done this before. Hopefully it was. What would you have me do, Ross? <laughs>